In this case, we have a 120 volt circuit with 12 ohms of resistance on it. What is the amp draw on this circuit? Well, what I love about formulas is we just plug in what we know. We know we have 120 volts. We know that we have 12 ohms of resistance. And we're going to look at this like a division line. We just take 12 and divide up into 120. We set it up like this. 120 divided by 12 equals 10. That lets us know that there should be 10 amps of current on this circuit. We should be able to read with our meter and verify that there is 10 amps. If there's not, if it's way low or way high, we know that we have a problem. Finally, we have a circuit with 10 amps on it and 12 ohms of resistance. What is the voltage? Well, we plug in what we do know. In this case, we're solving for E, and we know that we have 10 amps and 12 ohms. Now all we have to do